A dream trip to study abroad in Paris turned into a nightmare for a Post Falls woman and her family. Alicia Angeli was living in Paris for a year. She had just returned from a three-day pilgrimage with her boyfriend and friends when she found herself trapped in a building on fire. KXOY4's Grace Bitzler working for you tonight. Grace, this woman's fun trip to Paris ended with a near-death experience. Melissa, Alicia says she's learned two important lessons along the way. You can never be too prepared for an emergency, and you must accept the things in your life that are out of your control. And a warning, some of the images you're about to see may be upsetting. It was supposed to be a relaxing night. Alicia Angeli and her friend were in a seventh floor apartment. Uh, back in the day, that would have been a servant's chamber. The only way up and down from the apartment is the side spiral stairs. Then the unthinkable happened. We didn't know about the fire because there weren't any fire alarms in the entire building. Uh, we heard about the fire from a neighbor who was shouting at us from across the courtyard. They tried to get out through a stairwell. The fire that started on the first floor actually traveled to the bottom of the stairs and created a chimney that we were caught in. Alicia suffered second and third degree burns on her arms and legs. Our skin was like dripping off our hands and legs. Parisian firefighters arrived and the two escaped through a window. It was pure adrenaline and grace that helped me down the ladder. Alicia and her friend were taken to the hospital. Her friend there for three days. Alicia, a month. Alicia's boyfriend Steve was supposed to meet up with them that night. But it was kind of a, a surreal experience for the first two hours. I didn't know where they were, so it was just my imagination running wild. Instead, he told Alicia's parents the bad news, and his short vacation to Europe extended more than a month. Alicia says she's learned the importance of fire alarms and being prepared for an emergency. It's just the basics, fire escapes, fire alarms that could have prevented um, all of this happening, I think. Steve says he's amazed by the people who have rallied around them. In an experience like this, it's an opportunity for people to show that they care and show how they care. And Alicia has been humbled by the ordeal. These things happen, you just, you have to accept them. You can't fight against them. And Alicia says she's extremely grateful to her parents and her family who have been by her side this whole time. She's enrolled in the University of Dallas and hopes to be well enough to attend this fall. Reporting in studio, Grace Stitzler, KXLY4 News.